what is going on everybody get ready to do a PSA order I want to show what I'm gonna be submitting here I'm gonna try the 20 day order um, only reasons because these cards are definitely if they grade out will do more than uh, $500 so they wouldn't even be economy to begin with I'm kind of risking it because if they came out nines you're looking just a little bit more than a raw and I would still have to pay the upgrade, and they would just wait very for a long time to get done. So, figured what the heck we'll go for it. I usually don't show what I'm grading, but I'm going to give you guys a clues. Or not clues, a show, I guess you could say. Kyler Murray, red, white, and blue, rookie. Uh, I think PSA 10s, it'll definitely be over uh, uh, 500. It, it's, this one here is probably the one I'm probably the most worried about, to be honest. Uh, these are really hard grades from prison, but we'll give it a shot. Jacob Eason, only because these aren't really doing a whole lot raw, but just in case next year he starts, I want to get one of these graded quickly just so I have it in my possession type deal. I mean, a PSA 10 might be 150 maybe 200 bucks tops, but I figure I'll throw it in there. I don't want to try it on value because in case it does get bumped up and I'm just waiting that time. Alright, we got three hearts, mosaic rookies. These here, PSA 10 wise, I think once he hits rookie of the year are gonna creep around the 500, maybe even more. I don't know. So I'm gonna submit three of them in, see what happens with them. If they come back nines, so you're still over the dollar limit, so it's just one of those things you gotta take a chance on to. Two of the silver mosaics, as people like to call them. I call them just a true mosaic uh, from the years ago. These here, again, uh, you know, will be over $500 cards. So everybody knows me and Herbert's, that he's pretty much been attracted to me recently, and I'm really happy about it. Uh, this here, just a regular Prism rookie. We just want to get it graded. Easy as said. Nick Gonzalez, this is out of first edition. It is out of 25 orange. The the last raw I looked at a while ago was over at like 250-ish. I think maybe close to 275 if I recall right. So PSA 10 would bump it over. Me and Bowman just don't have PSA, but I figured I'd give it a shot. And finally, Zion, his stuff's exploding, as you guys noticed. Um, this here probably would creep up around 400 or so, but... Again, as a PSA 9, it goes over that threshold of uh, 200 or $199. So my whole thing is, why not just spend the extra money to get it back in like two months versus anything else? And what I was told when I talked to the reps at PSA was, so they receive it in. If you're doing anything that's like the $50 level or up, I forget what they're called, Express, Super Express, like I want it now and stuff like that. They have one to ten business days from once it gets scanned in on arrival to get it logged into the system. And when I talked to them, they were about two months from the time it gets logged in until it got completed. So I'm going to give it a shot and see what happens. I was going to push some bigger cards there too. But I'm going to hold off just to see how quick this goes around because the other ones, I mean, if they PSA 10... They're going to probably be hitting around capital. I know they changed it around. I just got to look at what it is. I, I think they bumped it one up to like 3000 or 2500 or something like that. But uh, got to get some stuff out there and get it graded. Get some stuff back quicker. Stuff is going to come back. But what is that? Eight cards? Two, four, six. Ten cards will go out to him. That's going to cost me just 500 in grades. I'm going to send this package. I was going to go to the UPS store in the morning, but I got a, uh, somebody come in the morning and do something in the house, hopefully. And I'm just going to send Priority Express and just pay the 22 bucks for it because they guarantee it one to three business days. If not, I get my money back. Versus if it goes UPS, it's going to take uh, three to four business days to get there. So... I figured I'll just do it this way. If it don't make it there, at least I can get a refund on to it. But we'll see what happens with it with the crazy mail system that's been going on. They should have it. 
been by New Year's Eve, scanned in, and then uh, probably logged in by middle of January, which means I should be getting results middle of March back on this, which makes me really happy to do. Uh, I might not even see another order back from PSA until then. I'm really hoping that's not the truth behind it. I'm hoping a couple of them will pop by then to get some cards back in because eventually you start running low on PSAs and back to graded stuff. And you're like, man, I don't want to get rid of any of this stuff to keep buying into the newer product because I'm one of the people I like to sell what I have before I start going in my pocketbook for a lot of stuff, unless it's PC, uh, just because I got similar stuff here. All right, that, that that's pretty much it, everybody. Um, by the time you guys watch this video, as you guys know, it's Sunday. The Steelers are losing. They're getting their butts kicked, so it's halftime. Uh, this order will already be out to PSA. Uh, I think I have this going to be scheduled Monday or Tuesday to pop online. And then I'm going to get a value one done here probably today, too, hopefully, if I have the time. If not, I'm still getting a value out before the end of the month. All right, everybody. Have a tremendous week out there. Stay safe on New Year's and all that stuff. I may be coming live uh, New Year's Eve. I'm not too sure. I'm thinking about just for maybe half hour, maybe an hour tops. Say hello to everybody. All right. Till then, take care. Have a good week.